How are you guys? So today we are in a 2015 Maserati uh, Gran Turismo that using the flip style key. Um, it's an old class situation. Um, so we're gonna do the redeem of data and everything and then we're gonna work you step by step. So we're gonna go to Maserati. Put the hazard lights on. Make sure your tool is connected to the internet. And the manual selection. And Turismo. It's uh, from 13 to 16. But we're just gonna go by blade key. And hit yes. You don't need to put the VIN manually. We just press OK to skip that. I'm gonna go to control unit, immobilizer. We're gonna switch the ignition on. this one and we're gonna go emo functions and we're gonna go for read immobilizer data hit ok and we're gonna press ok turn the ignition off This process should take about uh, between 10 to 20 minutes. I will just open the screen when I when it's coming back. So after uh, about 20 minutes, um, I got this. Uh, the only thing is when it tells you turn the ignition on, uh, make sure you take out the key, not just turn it off. Um, so after we have this, we're just gonna press OK. Uh, we're gonna save that file. We're just gonna put something so we can remember. And we're gonna press save. Reading successful. Uh, we can make a dealer key now. And they say if there is no communication, then shut the battery, but uh, it looks like we have communication. So we're just gonna press okay. Uh, now we're gonna need to uh, make a dealer key. We're going to go ahead and make the dealer key. We're going to choose the file that we saved. I'm going to press OK. I'm going to put a 48 uh, chip inside the programmer. And also, we have uh, generated successfully. I'm going to press OK. So, after we generated the dealer key, we're just going to go and do the key learning. Um, so before we do that, we're just going to put the key in on position and then we're just going to go and do key learning and we're just going to press OK. It's going to tell us to turn the ignition on. Now turn the ignition off. Now to insert the first key and to put it on. gonna ask says successful uh, we have one more key so we're just gonna put the second key and turn the ignition to on that's it we don't need any other keys and we're done now we're just gonna learn the remote so we're gonna go to remote control learning we're gonna switch the ignition to on And then we're gonna need to uh, press one of the keys. So just press the lock buttons. And we're gonna press okay. 
okay, that's it. And we don't want to do any another one. So learning is finished. Okay, job is done. Let's make sure the key starts the car. So we put it in on position. And the car is on. Job is done. And remote working as well.